Good morning. We're out at the uh, Atlas Center, uh, the pond out here. It's one of the few areas that can do a distance test. And it's uh, going to be pretty cloudy pretty soon, so I'm going to get this done. Bella's here. And uh, we're going to do uh, takeoff and see what the forced return to home does. Um, we're going to go into video. But I'm only going to go to 1080p and the frame rate's 30 frames per second, I can go 60, so let's do 60, just for fun. Okay, Bella, let's start the other camera because I want to get the takeoff for the hover. So we're going to start this now. And here we go. So, auto takeoff. It's going up, down, a little bit. It comes back up again. Slight breeze. Might be affecting it, but uh, I'd say it's not bad. And it's back to where it was. Now, this is 1.1.48. And I've got my stick extensions on. And this is 1.1.48, not 5.0, not 5.1. And it goes up and down a bit with the barometer. So let's take it up a bit. So we'll go back. And we're going to start the video. Start the video. We have 100% battery. Right a bit. Okay, what we're going to do is just going to hover there. Good lock, it's got 100% battery pretty well when I started. And we're going to go up to about 100%. how high we're going to go. Let's go up. Right now there's the pond there. There's the horizon. Where are we up to 38? We're going up to 50 meters, 55 meters. Yeah, well, that's good enough, 57 meters. Okay, so out there is the pond, and past that is a racetrack, or it's a harness racetrack. We're going to go out and see how far we get. Keep my eye on it. We're going straight forward. And we've got... Yeah, we're out at 125 meters. And this is straight stick forward. Yeah, everything else is zero, 100%. And when it disconnects, I'm just going to let go of the sticks and see what happens. And at 1.1.48, it's supposed to return to home, and when it comes back into connection, hover. So we're going to see if that happens. Well, we're still going. Let's see how far we go. And it'll disconnect. Three sixty-six. I got nothing. Okay. Can it go any further forward? No. We're up at six fifty. Enters GPS hold. Can we go any further? Yep. No, disconnected. Okay, Let's see what happens. Automatic return, GPS hold when it comes back. So, and it's disconnected again. So when it disconnects, it turns around, as it turned around, and it goes into GPS hold when it connects back and this is 1.1.48 1 
Okay, so if I push forward on the stick now, I'm not getting anything. GPS hold again, 576. disconnected again so that must be the bad area there so it goes into GPS hold it does return to home until it connects again see we're down to 523 GPS hold yep here it comes now we got full control again okay I believe nope, disconnect again must be some bad stuff up there but every time it disconnects it returns to home, and when it connects again, it goes into GPS hold mode. Okay, we're down to 398. There we go. Yeah, now we're coming back. See? Okay, so that's what happens in 4.48, 1.1.48. You'll go out, get disconnected, it'll automatically return to home, and as soon as it reconnects, it goes into GPS hold. It keeps going into GPS hold once it reconnects. If it disconnects completely again, return to home, <clears throat> as soon as it reconnects, GPS hold. And now we're at 300 meters, and we're coming back. So we're gonna do an auto return to home, and see where it lands. Which one is that one? This one. Automatic return. Let's see where it goes. So we're up there 64%. And it's coming back. And we're going to look for some crabbing. Now can I adjust? Yeah, I can adjust the camera. Here it comes. And we're up at 57 meters. So when it comes back, it doesn't drop altitude. So it's 57 meters. There it is. And I will cancel return to home if it's way off the mark. <clears throat> it's right above us now. We know where it took off. The other camera's still rolling and I'll get that on film. And it disconnected right above me because I wasn't paying attention. There it is. I had the sticks pointed the wrong way. It's coming down. And it is... Because it's right above me, you don't get much of a signal. Okay, let's point that back up again. Okay. Let's see where it lands. It should be in the screenshot now. And I haven't touched anything. It's automatic return. Boom. And it shuts off the motors. And I'm just going to stop the video. I can't go much wrong with that. Let's see what it looks like if I'm still in frame. Yep. So you be the judge. And that's the end of that one. So 1.1.48. 1 Here's another takeoff. take off and this time it held so it's not consistent and Marcus and Pollock and QC guy and all the others that do the Xenos I found that as well it's just not consistent we'll go up back go around the pond a bit come forward yeah 40% battery okay down we come should be in screenshot there there we go some left
down, and forward. There we go. What does that look like? There you go. And we'll try a hand catch. Thank you, Marcus. Pretty good.